Many of us like a drink. But did you know that in England, over 10 million adults drink more than the recommended low-risk guidelines of 14 units of alcohol a week? This, in turn, increases their risk of alcohol-related harm and ill health. All areas of society are affected by heavy drinking. On an individual level, it can seriously impact on health, well-being and relationships. Alcohol also carries a significant burden for the taxpayer, who has to support the substantial cost of public services. Despite the harms, many people struggle to estimate how much they drink and have limited knowledge of the risks. As part of a project funded by the Medical Research Council, we have run a public survey and focus groups and interviews with public health experts to understand what consumers know about the contents of alcoholic drinks and alcohol-related harms. Our survey found that less than one quarter of drinkers knew the recommended low-risk guidelines and only 13% correctly identified the number of units in a double whiskey. Over half of drinkers said that they were unaware or unsure of the relationship between alcohol and cancer. And over one third said that this information would make them drink less. These findings suggest that putting calorie, unit or health warning information on the labels of alcohol products could improve knowledge and encourage healthier consumption. However, this should be part of a broader approach to reducing alcohol consumption and alcohol-related harms, as labelling alone could be slow to implement and have limited impact in isolation. We have identified a number of possible ways to improve labelling, and you can find out more about our recommendations and follow future projects on our website and Twitter feed. Alcohol labels are not expected to change drinking overnight, but they could address consumers' right to information and help start the conversation around alcohol as a potentially harmful product. <laughs>